Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. So on my lips today, I'm wearing the Stay Quirky's liquid lipstick and I woke up like this. This has been my favorite shade for many years. These are extremely long wearing, very comfortable on your lips and this particular shade will suit every skin tone. So in today's video, I'm going to show you a very simple remedy for the hotter weather. For summers, this will help remove your tan. It will keep your skin looking fresh throughout summer. Plus, it's very cooling for your skin, so it will feel great. Um, very simple ingredients, very easy to make and very, very effective. So if you want to know how to make this mask, then please keep watching. So the first ingredient that you will need is a cucumber. Make sure you wash it really well so that you can use it with the skin. The next one is one tomato. You don't have to use the whole cucumber. Half of it is more than enough. But make sure to wash both these ingredients really well. I'm just going to cut off the ends and then use half a cucumber. Now, if you are not comfortable with the skin, you can always peel it. But I like using the skin. And I'm also going to cut the tomato and then put this in a grinder and grind it so that we can strain it and get the juice. Now, if you want to use this mask for your body, then use one whole cucumber and two tomatoes and that will be more than enough. You will not need more than this. But like I said, if you are not comfortable with the skin, you can always peel it. But make sure you grind it into a nice consistency so that it's easier to strain and you get the juice out of it. Make sure to add about half a cup of water so that it's easier to grind and you get the juice. And you can make a lot of this so that you can store it in the fridge for about three days and use it whenever you want and it's really cooling but i'm going to show you what you can do with this juice next now both tomato and cucumber are excellent to remove tan cucumber will also give your skin a very nice cooling effect now i'm just going to take a little bit of this juice and i'm going to add orange peel powder to it if you do not have orange peel powder you can always use lemon peel powder but make sure to use something uh, that is a little more stronger now once you've added that you're going to add sandalwood powder to this and mix it into a thick consistency thick paste so that it does not drip from your skin now I think sandalwood is much more effective to brighten up your complexion but if you do not have sandalwood you can always use multani mitti and mix it into a thick paste and use it now I personally prefer making my masks fresh and mixing the ingredients uh, when I'm going to use it and not storing the mask but like I said the juice keep it you can put it in a spray bottle or in some kind of bottle you can store it in the fridge and use it whenever you want later on in the video I'm going to show you how you can use this I've already washed and scrubbed my face I'm just going to put my hair back and I'm going to use this generously all over my face now if you want you can add kasturi manjal to it too if you have dark spots if you have pigmentation i haven't used it today which is like a surprise but uh, yeah i'm just going to apply this all over my face now here i'm applying this mask all over my face generously now because i was doing it on my bed i applied it only on my face but if you are going to use this do it in the bathroom use it all over your neck your back your hands your legs wherever you feel like there's tan and you want to remove the tan and brighten your skin apply this wherever you want and make sure before removing the mask to scrub it on your face for some time so that it also acts as a scrub so that this mask acts as a scrub and removes any kind of dead skin cells and improves the texture of your skin now obviously because i'm doing it on my bed i've applied it all over my face only but you can apply this on your neck your hands your legs wherever you have tan and you want to get rid of it you can use it and this will help you so i'm going to leave this on for about 20 25 minutes and then before washing it off i'm going to scrub it on my face so that it also acts as a scrub and removes any dead skin cells so i'm going to do that and come back to you come back to you i'm going to come back and show you what to do with the cucumber and tomato juice I 
I'm really sorry if it's noisy in the background. I have some guests at home. But as you can see, it instantly brightens your skin. It instantly removes any tan. Now, the juice, you can keep it in fridge and put it in a spray bottle and spray it on your face and use it as a toner. I'm just going to use a cotton pad and then just swipe it on my face. If you keep it in the fridge, you know, it's very cooling. So your skin will feel very refreshed. So I'm just going to swipe this all over my skin. Now, once you use the cucumber and tomato juice as toner, you can see how beautiful and glowy your skin looks. Now, you can stop here, but if you do struggle from acne scars and marks and uh, pigmentation and you want to make the uh, mask more effective, you can go on with some kind of serum. And because it's summer, you would need something that controls oil and is not too heavy on your skin. So here I have three affordable options. One is the Good Vibes Tea Tree Plus Mulberry Oil Control Plus Skin Glow Serum. This is also very good. You can also use Good Vibes Vitamin C and Vitamin E Age Defying Serum. I use this during periods and it really helps control uh, the extra sebum production. Or you can go with the Rose Hip Radiant Glow Face Serum. Again, this is a light serum and it will help your skin be radiant and supple so that's it for the video guys i will leave the links to everything in the description box you can use this face mask three times a week or whenever you've gone out and you have some kind of stubborn tan and you want to get rid of it you can use it then you can use it anywhere on your body but do not store the mask just make sure to um you know always mix fresh um ingredients so that it's more effective but the juice you can keep it in the fridge for about three days and you can use it whenever you want you don't have to use it only after the mask you can spray it throughout the throughout the day throughout the day and it will keep your skin really glowy and radiant and help uh keep the tan away i will meet you guys in my next video until then bye